Today I'm going to share with you high self esteem in youth. When I was a teenager for some time, I suffered from low self esteem as I was discounted because of the locality I came from. Low self esteem people create a negative image of themselves. They lack confidence, find it hard to make and keep friendships, may feel victimized by others. They can't deal well with failure, are not proud of what they achieve and are constantly comparing themselves to their peers in a negative way. On the other hand, high self-esteem people have a positive image of themselves, are confident and responsible. They take on challenges, overcome setbacks, work well in groups, have a greater sense of self-control and achieve success and happiness. As I look back now, I realize the problem was not with my locality or teachers or anything outside of me. It was me. I was my own worst enemy. People tend to look at you the way you look at yourself. If you want people to like and respect you, you need to love and respect yourself first. There is no other way. God made each person unique. Each person has his or her own area to master. They need to begin developing those special skills and talents that are theirs. Involving in youth activities helps them to realize the talents and skills they are blessed with. One of our youth who was shy realized that he had natural skills of animating while animating for a summer camp which we were organizing. And he seemed to evolve from a shy young teenager to a radiant confident man right before my eyes. I see the same thing happening to others who make the best and most of what they are. Some youth may say they don't have any special talent or skill. They may end up by simply saying that I am just a dumb, boring person and there is nothing so special about me. But this is simply not true. Working with youth for several years, I have come across hundreds of them who I have got to know closely. I found every one of them had some quality or strength I admired. I believe no one is an exception to this rule. Our responsibility as adults is to offer every youth who comes to us an opportunity to discover what God has gifted him or her with and help to develop that. Here are 10 tips that I have picked up to build self-esteem. First, have positive self-talk. Chance like I can, I will, I must really helps. Two, change your mental diet. Whether books, music, movies or TV program, see that they are uplifting. Three, upgrade your physical diet. When you take care of your body by having a balanced meal, you will naturally feel better and, and more happy. Four, stop comparing yourself with others. If you want something to measure yourself by, compare how you were yesterday to how you are today. 5. Create an uplifting environment for yourself. This can be joyful colors, natural uh, photos, plants, also wear clothes that you feel good in. 6. Create a list of accomplishments and review it often. We tend to get overwhelmed looking at what's left to be done and forget to give ourselves credit for how far we have already come. 7. Learn something new. The Google is a real blessing when it comes to learning anything under the sun. Whether it's cooking, handicraft, even dancing. 8. Do something nice for someone else. Volunteer. Being of service without expectation of reward feels really good. You can do it in your neighborhood or hundreds of charity institutions in the city. 9. Spend time with supportive, uplifting people. If you are surrounded with so-called friends who put you down, it's time to move out 
if you cannot correct them 10 celebrate and thank god celebrate your successes and uh, progress is worthy of celebration and before you go to bed each night recollect all the good times and thank god remember think highly of yourself for the world takes you at your own estimate thank you for listening to me